Finally, the sun is out. Holy, what's up guys? How's it going? Mark from 408. We're down here and we've decided it's car jumping day. So Scott's idea, I'll give him all the credit. It's a good day for it. It's a great day for day. So make sure you check out the links below. And yeah, basically, I think we're going to jump the old Honda today. This thing is done. I think we're going to try and start it once more today. We tried to seize it with... Uh, with uh, that prime energy drink there. And it uh, seems pretty well, so. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Looks good. I think we can get at least a half turn out of it. And then as you can see, I did a massive burnout on the windshield with the Maverick. Make sure you go check out that video. That was lots of fun. But yeah, this thing, apparently it still runs. I know it makes lots of noise and uh, it doesn't really have power steering or anything, but uh, she's got a race flap on the back. Convertible, I forgot. We, yeah, well, yeah. It's, it's the Elka Honda, the Elka Honda, Elka Honda Chevy. It does look Elka cool. Chivic, Chevy Chivic, Chivic, Elka Chivic. So, we're gonna try and jump this thing, and then uh, we might just buzz over to Turtle Island, see what's uh, going on down there. So, actually, I think the last car jump you were here for was that the Brad's parents, yeah. the yeah. high was that Kier oh, Hyundai. Yeah, same Korean thing. Car. Yeah. Anyways, so it looks like there's a car battery up there. Yeah. Is that battery? Is that part, part of the? Uh, might the be a. Fa machine? Actually, it's probably yeah part of the washing machine. I don't know if you guys saw that video, but you definitely have to check out the washing machine tannerite explosion. I was actually talking to a neighbor up the road, and he's like, "Yeah, we heard an explosion here a month or two ago." I'm like, hmm, wasn't me. Wasn't me. Ah, yeah, the old inner fender. Anyways, let's uh, fire up the old boosters. Also, we got this um, we got this car diagnoser. So it's from Think Car. Check them out. Comes in a very nifty case with all the different cables and accessories. So I've been trying to activate it. Chris activated it under his name, so I had to switch under my name. But yeah. Let's plug her in the Civic and the Chevic and see, uh, see if there's anything wrong with see it. See if she's throwing any codes. All right, let's do this. So she's just a little Bluetooth plug that uh, plugs in your car there. Oh, it's wireless. Yeah, wireless. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Starts every time. Eighty percent of the time, every time. Honda, what's a Sherry? There's a lot of interesting uh, cars on here. Honda. Bluetooth. All right. We'll let you know how she goes. This thing is loud. It's loud. I you like flexing? it. flexing? Pumped. Open. Can't believe this thing still moves. All right. We're just running a check here. Seems to be failing everything. Scott's going to try and start the Ford in the meantime. Still going? Oh, yeah. Good God just hates bumper. I think your angle of execution is a little off. <laughs> you have a lot of hate against bumpers. What's wrong? What's wrong with the bumper? <laughs> oh. Oh. Why don't we just hit it with that car? I guess that car doesn't move. Yeah, we're gonna start it. Yeah. Okay, I'm over this. This will fall off halfway down Your the jump. I guess you need the keys, and I gotta. Hook up both booster packs. I think we're gonna need all the juice. Try and start it without it. See if there's anything in it. It's always a good sound. All right, let's rig these things up. There's glass all over the truck. That's weird. See. Probably rubber too. Go time. All right, give her a whirl. Hold on. I'll give you a Let me restart this. Go full power. 
Fire away. We should just put some vegetable oil on it. It should probably run fine. I bet that works. She sounds healthy. That was hilarious. I can't believe she went up and going again. Apparently you just gotta let it sit and marinate and rust a little bit. There's no oil or anything in this. This engine is completely dry on the inside. The only lube is the gasoline, so. All right, I'll turn these things off. Thank you to the Hulkman and the old, why are you beeping at me? I definitely like the NOCO better than the Hulkman. They both work good, but this one's got a bigger set of nuts. This one has too many safeties. Like, why is it beeping at me? Go away, stop it. You figured out. <laughs> I'm gonna check our uh, our diagnosed car here, our Chevik. She's overheated. All right, what do we got here? Anti-lock braking system, low voltage. Curtain left airbag inflator. Oh yeah, we lost that airbag. Oh no. What? You lost an airbag? Yeah. Not be Apparently, our left side curtain airbag. Yeah. Oh, it's back there. It's got to be plugged in. Oh, he's got to plug in. All right. Yeah. Well, let me enter it and see what it says here. Turn ignition off. On. Communicating. Come on. Can we just... Here, I'll just clear the fault code. I don't know this thing well enough to know what I'm doing yet. Clear fault code. There we go. Boom. 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 There, we're good to go. All right, I like this thing already. What else we got? Everything else looks good. It's just the ABS and the uh, the supplemental inflatable restraint system. Oh. Thank God we got the NOCO. All right, let's jump this thing. Setting up cameras. We got three cams today. Actually, we got five. Because last time we set up five, I think two worked. <laughs> so let's hope all five works today. We also have piled some tires on the back to get ejected. Or when it nose dives, it'll take out the front seat. Well, so. it also acts as a roof if it goes upside down. Oh, yeah. That cushions it. And, uh, you know, traction, right? Because it's uh, rear drive. So, you know, especially with our, rear drive Civic. our spoiler. Civic? Well, it's a, it's a Chevic. They come rear row. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get your facts straight. <laughs> I should be better educated. Oh, oh yeah, there's the airbag. It's, looks like it's still there. Oh, we just need to attach it. You yeah. cut the airbag though. Oh yeah. Well, oh. it'll make a big farting sound when it goes off. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be amazing. Well, see you at the top of the hill. Oh, wait, come over here for a second. Why? Remember I put this on? We had to wait for it to dry. Oh yeah. Look how crusty it is. Oh, look at that. Brand new sticker. See, oh, that's yeah. why we left the cover on. To pr clean. protect it from all the freaking rubber. Perfect. Team LTD. Come on. Oh, look how sticky this window looks. That's gross. Yes. Jumping time.
They didn't make it. <laughs> One's right here. I thought it was going to keep going for a second there. Right into the river? I don't know. I heard it's still revving up. There you go. There's your bumper. Are you happy? We can probably jump it again. The wipers work. Oh, yeah. It'll probably fire up again. These. It seems like the crappier the car is, the better, you know, it stays alive. Are you happy your bumper fell off? I am. I don't have to try to kick that anymore. Something hit me in the air. I already smacked my head on the way out. But... <laughs> All right, let's check, let's out, check the, it out the DiMaggio. What did I say? Did I say it was going to land on the top? He did. Try again. That doesn't sound right. Should we uh, diagnose it and see what's wrong? Yeah. <laughs> I think there might be an engine problem. Oh. All right, we'll go grab the booster and uh, see if we can fire this thing up. Well, we got the NOCO. We got our first jump out of it. I have not seen the jump yet. I might uh, review the game tape real quick, but I think we can get another solid jump. What do you think? I think so. It's a great day for a great day, so. Great day for a great day. Great day for hay, don't you say? She's still beeping at you. Help, help, help. Somehow hit some mud. Oh, when I was heading to the top of the hill, it's all mud up there. I'm like, oh no, That's don't. Get stuck <laughs> yeah. And then I was trying to back it up, straighten, straighten her up, but uh, she kept getting um, not much traction on the old grass there. Let's see. Yeah, this thing's mint. It's good to go. All right, fire it up, see what she's got. Come on, girl, let's get a second out of you. Broke her windshield. Up the gas. Turn it. Man, the bugs are crazy down here. They're not biting, they're just annoying. Can you turn the choke on? Yeah. Oh. I know the Fords have like a, a fuel switch turn off. I don't think the Civics do. We might have ripped some stuff off underneath. The fuel light's on. Just out of gas? He's thinking about it. Five Might have to diagnose it and clear Three. the codes. One. Let her breathe some more. There might be a little ether left. I feel like we blew through it all last time. Got some spray paint. Seems like it wants to. It's so close. Oh. Oh, did you hear that? Maybe we should just let it wait. Wait a few minutes. How's the heat? Is she hot? She hot? Does it show anything on the dash? Uh, heat is fine. Heat is fine. Good. It's like mid level. Mid level. Did you hear that? Yeah. yeah. Come on, I think we could, we need a second one out of this. All right, we'll I take- I give it a second. Yeah, let's give her a sec. We'll tune back in a minute. What you got? Let's see, we're good about 35 seconds. Yeah. That's plenty of time. She's sounding better. Don't want to give it gas? I'd keep pumping it. Come on, girl. The other, the other booster pack? I was thinking we'd diagnose it and see what's wrong. Yeah? It's got lots of power. It doesn't need the other booster pack. Yeah. Just sounds like it's not getting fuel. Just some faults. Might be that giant tear right there. Uh, I'm guessing the AC. AC hose. That's definitely not a fuel hose. <laughs> That's what, I think that's where your blinker fluid. It might be low on that actually. 
so close. It's probably just out of gas. Could be. Come on, girl. Come on. We're the team. We're the team. I'm gonna walk over and get the scanner. Probably doesn't help that this is full of dirt, but we have about half a square of ether left, so give her a whirl. I can't hit it. I can't hit it at the right angle here. There's not enough in it. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to grab the other one. Dang. Scott's taking us home. New souvenir. Taking it home? Hang her up in the wall. You looking at chunks of the uh, washer? There. Oh. <laughs> Hoping for more ether. I still think. I don't know. I just believe. I believe we can get a second one. I feel like it's just out of fuel. Maybe I ripped the fuel line off. I didn't smell any gas over there though. All right, we gotta switch to the Hulkman. We're out of juice. Way more juice. So low. See, we didn't need to scan it. No. Honestly, I just think it's out of gas. Little gas lights on. We might just have to drag her back there and do this another day too. Yeah. All right, let's do that. Save it for another day. Well, we're taking a fiver. We killed both booster packs trying to start it. It did start for a little second there, but ran out of juice, so. It is progress. We're gonna reevaluate ourselves, get some water, get some gas, and uh, play it by beer. We've jumped in the Maverick, see where we end up. Can't stop yet. We've got to keep this thing going. Whew. All right. Ooh, far away. See that number where? Number where? Number everywhere, every day. How's the footage look? Good. Great nice. enough for a new phone background? <laughs> got to clear that one video. Yeah, that's the thing when you do a slow mo and it films eight minutes and turns into Let's like say 45 minutes. Alright, let's just turn it down. Oh yeah, look at that. Got the shot. Oh, the bumper drag. <laughs> oh, and the drone, how nice. Boom. Oh, it hit the house. <laughs> Scared those birds. <laughs> That's actually, <laughs> sounds like an explosion. <laughs> See, far away, it's everywhere. We got some gas. Put a little in the truck too, just in case. There we go. We got some dirt bike action. I'm trying to jump cars, we got freaking dirt bikes showing up. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. All good, as long as the track's getting used. <laughs> well, they're having uh, fun over there. Oh yeah, it's charged up enough, eh? We got some race gas. Our next... Can we get it in? Yeah, how are we gonna get it? We never really thought of that. Why don't you use your... I'll use my foot. I got work boots up. hi -ya! Come! That was a good kick. Actually, I got a crowbar in the back. I'll just lift it. I don't know, you're the strongest guy here, so you should probably do this. Watch your fit. <laughs> oh, that would suck. We need more leverage. Come on, muscles. I don't want to be in front of that airbag. Oh! Jesus. That's what I was worried there about. There we go. You good? Not good. There we go. You scare me sometimes. <laughs> we'll get in here. Hey, it's just oh, got to come twist. off. It doesn't have to go back on. <laughs> still twist. Ugh. Boop. Boop. All right. Throw a few uh, expensive liters in there and we're good to go. Jeez, look at that thing. 
<laughs> Just remember, this was your idea. I don't, was it? <laughs> Making the convertible. Oh, yeah. Uh, Not a four. One Mississippi. Two Mississippi. Let's see. You turn her on? Yeah, I believe in you. You have the magic touch. Where's the key? I guess you need the key, eh? Sorry by my receipt here. Oh, it's back in the truck. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, I don't know why I took them out. All right. All right. All right. What do we got? No, yeah. Hold on. Relax. What about now? Now? You're good. What about now? You're good. Pump it. Keep going. Don't got much juice left. Should we double them up? I don't know. Can't believe it ran for a sec there. I know. I gotta let the fuel pump run here. Just twist it a few times. I don't smell gas or anything. Might have to just drag her over there and let her sit for the night or a few days. Just hold her right down until you kill the NOCO. Just keep pumping it. Sorry, Sivvy. Until next time. All right, let's go for a little Maverick tour. We'll drag this thing out of the way and then we'll go for a Maverick tour. We got the Yankum rope. We got Scott the Yanker. Let's drag this thing home. See if he clears it. Nope. Lost the fender on the uh, Durango. She was almost good. Once I hit it, I realized, like, uh oh, we put that front tire. So it doesn't look like it's sliced it. It good. cranked it hard, though. Yeah. You were supposed to stay in the Civic and drive it, Scott. You didn't tell me that. I'm sorry. I thought we communicated. Like no. This... Anyways, this Yankum rope does absolutely amazing. She's pretty muddy right now from the last few weeks of rain and mud, but. She strikes again. And yes, there is a discount code below if anyone wants one. Freaking bugs, Scott. Tell your bug buddies to go away. Should we uh, go get the map and go for a little rip? Let's do it. <laughs> well, after three years of asking, looks like Hydro One finally cut this tree down. She was a big one. I don't know if it would have landed on the house if it fell over, but uh, she was definitely ready to either fall on the neighbor's house or on the, uh, on the shack there. Some nice wood. I think we should we drag that with a maverick? Yeah. Take it down to tur turtle. Yeah. Firewood. Just, just drag the whole thing down the river. Uh, I can roll it. Roll it. They see me rolling. No, like... Ooh. Totally forgot to wash this thing again. I'm usually pretty good at that. I'm usually pretty good at washing stuff right after, but it's been so hectic lately. Bring her out. Those studded tires. Gotta wait till next next winter though. Only got one use out of them this year. The assassinators look good. I have so many freaking tires. Come on! Whoa! -ho! You gotta put it in gear first. She's, she's good. She's in. Roll her forward. Come on! You got tons of room, straight out. Oh yeah. You ready for a rip? <laughs> oh man, my dirty old hook. Took my license plate off because people kept reporting me. Thanks to YouTube, thanks to all the fine folks on YouTube. All right, let's go for a rip. Let's do this. Money, money, money. Look at all those cars we could be jumping. <laughs> they really cleaned this place up, that's for sure. Maybe they got in trouble.
level. This trail's a little muddy, not too bad. It's a little bumpy. How you doing over there? Should bring some gravel, really smooth this out. <laughs> yeah. Should we take the deep rut? Might as well. Let's try and roll it right off the start. Oh, oh yeah. You like dragons? <laughs> Why? I can't tell you. <laughs> Yeah. Make it under that tree? <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. This is why I do like the Mavericks, because they do sit a little lower than the Polaris's, and if there's a tree falling over, you can slide right under there. Good. And then take a tree to the face. It's much easier. <laughs> there's definitely lots of mud down here, that's for sure. I guess it did rain for a week straight. It did. And uh, yeah, the river was up pretty high. Look at that. We found a use for this. Yeah, put that right in there. Yeah. Super ATV roof bag. <laughs> roof bag. Roof that bag. Sounds like oh. a swear oh. word. You're a roof bag. It's a good, uh, it's a good insight. This is the best way to clean your machine up. Best way to get your work boots wet, too. Keep them up. I think I'm still dryish. <laughs> We're almost there. <laughs> the junk is wet. <laughs> Man, this thing's got a lot of pep in the hole. Oh. And we made it. Well, good news. We're a little cleaner now, I think. Yeah, those rims look nice. A lot cleaner? Getting to high. Oh yeah, that knocked a lot of mud off. Look, somehow my boots didn't get wet. Did you pee your pants? I tried. <laughs> we made it. Man, that active suspension, game changer. Oh, so nice today. If you guys aren't out getting after it, enjoying that sunshine. Well, I just don't know. I just don't know. She's growing in quick, though. I don't think many people come down here in the summer. Oh, yeah. Good times, good times. Clean up your garbage, people. That's one thing that bugs me. It's my buddy, Eagle Eagle. His actual name is George, the bald eagle. Okay, why do you got to say bald like it's a bad thing? <laughs> okay, we don't group people into bald or hair. Are you offended? I am offended. As a bald man, I'm upset. Bald phobic? Yeah, I'm bald phobic. <laughs> Just an eagle, okay? Every time we come down here, there's a bald eagle. They're always flying by the farm, too. Here, bud. He's probably waiting for our freaking oh, sweet chips. Oh, we gotta put chips. a yum yum. Yeah, get him a yum yum. Hey, buddy, come get a yum yum. Get a yum yum. <laughs> yeah, and we're off. And next time, we'll plan a full full lunch in Next here. Next time we're gonna do some archery. Take down the bald eagle, have some bald eagle steaks. Yeah, be good, be good. Pure protein. Yeah. Stop calling it a bald eagle, okay? <laughs> it's just an eagle. Feathery white eagle. Yeah. This is how I was either. gonna say, call it a whitehead eagle, but I don't even know if you can do that. Yeah, I don't know if you're allowed to do anything anymore. We're thinking about crossing over here. I don't know how deep it is here. Oh, look at that fish. Fishy! See him? I can see it here. Oh, yeah, he's like, he's still there. He's like six inches. <laughs> I was it's trying to out. use my polarized glasses here from Detour, but I think he got away. He's too far now, but he was a good six to eight inches. Oh yeah, I should put it low, low and let her fly. I think it was a trout. A trout. Hey, figure it out, you trout. No. This is how we wash this thing. Here, Mr. Trout! Who needs a car wash when we got 4x4 four four low? You get wet. Yeah. Wet's a good thing, but this is ridiculous. <laughs> Warp speed.
landed a quite the wake there. Yeah, I, was I was trying to get it to come over the front. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, you see it's a little wet now. Oh. Look at that. It's time for some freshies on this thing. We still got to burn these off all the way. All the way. Just keep a little nubs on it. Oh, the old General Tires Grabber ATs. Definitely an awesome tire. I know I talk about them a lot, but I do believe in this tire. I'm not just promoting it for, for fun. These are definitely an unreal tire. So anyways, we're going to wrap this one up for now. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the old Civic, the Chevic car jump. Yeah, okay, good. We will get it going again. I promise you that. And then we'll get more cars and then we'll jump more cars and then cars on cars. Cars on cars. Cars on cars. All right. Have a fantastic day, guys. Check out the links below and we'll see you later. Bye-bye.